Hi guys, my name is Yuri. Welcome back to another YouTube video. And today I'm going to talk about what are relative major and relative minor and how do they work. Relative keys consist of the same key signature, meaning both relative major and minor will have the same number of sharp or flats. So basically, there is a relative major and relative minor in every single note, especially if you want to compose your own music. It is a very helpful tool and it makes everything easier if you want to have modulations within your composition. The term modulation means the change of key. What we usually see the most is modulate from relative major to relative minor or the other way around. Modulation is so common because it makes the composition sound more interesting. And now, how on earth are we going to look for the relative minor from the relative major? It's actually really simple. So let's say I am in G major, and to find out its relative minor, all you need to do is counting three semitones downwards to the left from G major. And here we go, the relative minor of G major is E minor. Now, I will show you how to look for the relative major from relative minor. Again, it's not as difficult as you think, the process is quite similar, but this time counting three semitones upwards from the relative minor. So if I'm in A minor, counting three semitones up and we will get a C major. And there you go, the relative major of A minor will be C major. See, it's not that complicated after all, right? Today's video is quite short, it's all about understanding between relative major and relative minor. So in the next video, I'll be showing you how to imply this method when we are learning to play minor skills. Well, if you enjoyed this video, do give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I make video based on basic music theory and piano playing. If you are a total beginner in music and don't know where to start, I have a playlist for that. You can check that out in my channel. Have a wonderful day and I'll catch you guys next time. Bye!